50 friends. I want to share a mini album I did for my niece's um, gender reveal. Now they're having gender reveals. Um, my glasses turned to sunglasses in the sun. Um, I used this paper pack, which is called Fiesta Fever. Her um, gender reveal is going to have a Cinco de Mayo theme. So I made um, this mini album I wanted to share with you guys. Okay, here it is. Okay, I used that paper pack and um, this was a cut apart from the paper pack and this is a die from Alina Cuddle from Ally Express and I did put um, those little uh, flowers that we put on the shakers, I put it on um, her hair and she is going to be wearing blue flowers so I think it's going to be a boy and I think mostly everybody thinks it's going to be a boy but we'll see. I would love a girl. But boys are fine too. All I have is one boy too. But it would be nice to have a girl to play dollies. Not that I can't play dollies with um, boys too. But here we go. This is the cover. And this is the back, the side and the back. Um, I used a tonic die, a mini album die, which was um, fairly easy to use. Um, and also there's a lot of YouTube channels on how... Um, to put it together which were very helpful excuse me guys it's a little windy but i wanted to take um advantage i am going to the gender reveal today so i wanted to do a quick video on what the mini album sorry i blocked you guys sorry about that here we go okay and here is the inside okay sorry about the shaky camera oh, let me try to like i said it is windy out but it's gorgeous okay and this is also a cut apart I did take um I made some ephemera well some stickers using my Cricut with a digital file a Cinco de Mayo digital file which was um very cheap I think it was like a dollar ninety for the digital file so that was a good price and this is a pocket you can put something in there and then I made a shaker this um, also is from that digital file the gender reveal I put with a script from my Cricut that I found um, the script that kind of matched the Cinco de Mayo theme okay and there and if you look at the shaker it has some um, tiny little avocados in it it's really cute and what's cute too is I made it so she could put a picture inside right there so I put a little string she could put a little picture in there of the sonogram or of the baby once the baby is born this is the next page I know um, the skulls are more of El Dia de los Muertos but it's still cute and the album is cutesy my niece has um, similar taste to me she does like cutesy stuff so and this is the next page okay and these are um, doodle bug little um, flowers. They're like s decorative little flowers. They come like in a ream. I think I got it on Tuesday morning. And also in here, you could put a picture in here. I put one of those Target um, see-through pockets. And then she could just put a photo in there to match. And a little llama. This little llama is from um, Mommy Lay. I used to have the Mommy Late Little Bits box, and that's from there. Okay, and then here, I just made with a little magnet, two little things. And you gotta open this one in order to open this one right here. So we open these, you can put photos in there too. Sorry if there's shadows and glares, guys. There you go, and sorry about, like I said, it's windy. Oh, and also, inside each one's, I put, so lots of spaces to put photos. See, and right here, you have, right there, there you go. You can put a photo in there, and this one too. this one okay and this is actually this one has it this one is a fun page this is okay 
I wrote, I put a little thing, it's what will it be? And a little question mark. And then here I put niño o niña. And then as a, you know, kind of like a surprise, just like a gender revealed. We'll open it up on the ribbon. And here you go. And there, and it says surprise. And there she can put a picture of when she does do, here we go. When she does do the open, um, the gender reveal, she can put the photos. Sorry guys about the shaky camera, so sorry. I'm just trying to be in a rush. I just wanna make sure I show you guys, see if I can inspire somebody, show you guys what I did before I head out. It's gonna be an hour and a half away, so. And like I said, my niece is very similar to me, so her style's like me, she likes cutesy stuff, so that's why the album is a little cutesy. Okay, and here we go and that's the next page here she can also here's the target pocket again and this is also a mommy lay ephemera and um, also that doodle bug little trims that I use okay and here I put another mommy lay this is a cut apart from the paper pack and then it's just a little magnet in there and it holds it and then she has lots of space Lots of space here in this waterfall to put photos. There we go. There we go. Let me close that up with the little magnet. There you go. Right here. This is the last page. Also a mommy lay cut apart. And these are also digital digital file I got from Etsy if any of you guys want to know what the digital file just let me know in the comments and um, I'll put you where I got it. and I put a little pocket you could put extra pictures stickers or anything like that a lot all the leftover paper I'm gonna give her so she can customize whoever she wants and my sticker happily made with this little dude here he's so cute so yeah guys that was my mini album that I covered and I put this little ribbon actually I'm not super crazy about the ribbon I wish I would have used maybe a yellow ribbon but it was too late I put it on but it's okay all right all right guys I hope you're having a beautiful day enjoy your day happy crafting